day four here at Oshkosh 2023. Finds me in AFWorks tent once again, some of the latest and greatest technology that's hitting the market. So I'm with uh, Chris Black, and we're work with, working with uh, Maiman Aerospace here. So Chris, what do we have here? What are we, uh, what are we looking at for uh, the future? This is pretty awesome. Yeah, this is a, we call this a speeder. Uh, this is a turbine-powered, high-speed, compact VTOL aircraft, mainly used for cargo. Right now we're in the configuration where you could put a man on it, but most of the use cases are going to be for cargo. And you can stick a wing on it, very modular, and you can expand it out so that it uh, carries larger loads. You could make it smaller. The, the whole idea is that the concept can be changed to whatever you, um, you feel like, what, what, what the needs of the customer are. So a vertical takeoff and landing, but also what's your max speed or cruise speed that you would look for? Yeah, so with the unmanned cargo version, with a wing, we're getting about Mach 0.75. That's the design uh, speeds that we're getting. What are you looking at for the, the military applications of this? Yeah, so uh, getting blood and bullets to the people on the front lines, tight situations where it's risky to get a helicopter involved or there's no way to get a helicopter in there at all. A lot of situations where you want to get critical components and they don't weigh too much. You don't want to send a whole helicopter with a crew, get, get anybody involved like that, putting people at risk. We're decentralizing the, the whole concept. Rather than having to spend a lot of money on a Black Hawk helicopter, you could use that same money to buy 40 of one of these and um, really spread your assets out so you're not a single target, uh, very attributable, kind of spreading that, the resources out. What kind of cargo weight do you look at for this on a normal day? Something this size, this will carry around 600 pounds of payload. And looking at uh, going into the future, the commercial applications or even the private applications, is that uh, one of those areas you're looking at as well? Yeah, definitely cargo, um, for offshore oil rigs, firefighting applications, um, emergency response, things like that. With a lot of emergency response, you, you just don't have access to a helicopter. You don't, you don't have time for a car. We got something in between. You know, the, there's a little electric drones and then there's helicopters and there's nothing in between. And so we're that vehicle that's in between. That is some pretty exciting news, and I uh, look forward to seeing uh, more coming from you guys. Um, are you looking for anybody to add to your team? Um, yeah, we're always looking for great talent. We're always looking for good engineers, good aerospace engineers, software, hardware, everything like that. We're, we're, uh, we're always expanding. We're, we're doing good, so, so we're looking for good, good, talented engineers. Where can people find you on the web? Yeah, so we're maimanaerospace.com. Aerospace.com.